Feels good to be making this video, everybody. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. Ooh, I am excited for this video, guys. It has been quite a long time. Let's be real for a second. There's been a gaping hole in my life for the past couple of weeks. I have not been building a mock. No doubt, almost all of you are subscribed for my mock series. Obviously, that is what my channel focuses on. For the past couple of weeks, even larger than a month right now, I'd say even maybe even two months, I have not been making a mock. Ever since I uploaded the finale of Crate right before Brick World Chicago, I have not been working on a project, and that has been something that I have absolutely hated. Guys, I love building mocks, dioramas of battles and scenes from Star Wars. As you guys know, in today's video, I'm going to be announcing the next brand new project that we are going to be working on. But before I do kind of get into this video, I do want to say four quick things that I kind of thought about in my head while choosing the scene or the planet for the next project. Number one, I wanted the availability to make my own custom ship. I feel like that's my own kind of next step in my mock building and YouTube career. Number two, I want it to be movie accurate because not a lot of people have seen Battlefront 2 and compared to the movies. Number three, I want a scene or a planet that offers a lot of room for different details, including light up bricks, um, just smaller in interior details, stuff like that. And number four, guys, I do want to do something that not a lot of other bigger YouTubers are doing. That way we can kind of avoid the comparisons um, between my mock. So that being said, guys, what is the next mock? First of all, I do want to thank all of you for joining me on my crate journey. And if you guys are brand new, make sure you go ahead and subscribe for those awesome weekly mock series videos. But I have baited you guys long enough. The next project that we will be doing is this. Guys, we are going to be working on Kessel, the Kessel Run from Solo. It is going to be bigger than Create. In fact, it's going to be a 4x4 base pit or a 5x5 five foot, five foot table. Ever since I saw Solo, I knew I wanted to do a Kessel mock. I just thought that was such a really cool scene. The way we saw Han, Chewie, Lando, Kira, even L3 sacrifice herself. That was just a really awesome battle scene to me. It was just so entertaining and I feel like I just wanted to make that mock. Honestly, I thought the Solo movie was fantastic. I know a lot of you guys probably did not. However, um, I do want to make what I want to make. So guys, the next project that I will be bringing to Brick World 2019, Brick Fair Virginia 2019, and maybe even one more convention is going to be your man's Han and Chewie from Solo. Like I said, guys, we are going to be doing it movie accurate, so I'm going to be using Battlefront 2 as a reference. However, I will not be using Battlefront 2 as the main focal point of my mock. I do plan on doing it movie accurate to Solo, meaning we are going to pretty much depict the scene where Chewie and the other Wookiees are kind of pushing that cart of Coaxium up into the Falcon, where Han and Lando kind of have their guns perched stuff like this, kind of protecting them. We're going to do that kind of whole scene, uh, Kira throwing her grenade, all the mountains and the extensive pipes. We are going to also include an interior, which is very, very exciting. Something that I did miss out on Crate and something that I'm really looking forward to uh, in Kessel. In terms of improving my building quality, I'm going to be including light up bricks, a little bit like my own interpretation. I'm going to be building it like a prison courtyard or something like that where it's going to be. I basically want to have like prison lights shining down on the courtyard area where the Falcon is. want to have maybe some barbed wire. I am going to be including light in my own custom UCS Kessel Run Falcon. I am so excited to be starting to work on this, guys. As you all know, I did just say I wanted to start including my own custom creations, and um, this is just a project that is calling my name. I'm very, very excited for this. Like I said before, bigger than Crate. I do have to order a new table, because right now, guys, it is not big enough to, to fulfill that 4x4 or 5 feet by 5 feet mock dimensions. But guys, I hope you are all excited for this. I have been waiting to announce this for the longest time. I've actually been planning this pretty extensively ever since since Brick World 2019, I cannot express to you how excited I am to actually start this project. Now, the only bad news, guys, I do have for you is I'm not going to be able to start building this probably until, at the very least, the weekend after Brick Fair Virginia, probably even mid to late August when I actually be starting this. Um, number one, I still have Crate to bring to Virginia. Two, I'm still trying to find funds for the next mod. I'm just trying to find some more monies. Don't worry, guys, that first weekend, that week one update will come like that. It's going to be an amazing time. So, guys, let me know down below what you think of this mock choice. Also, let me know what you guys think of my new sake fig that I got. It is probably updated already if you guys have not seen it. Um, this is basically the Leonard Leonard head from Big Bang and then it is a helmet and the rest of it is from the UCS Y-Wing pilot. So let me know what you think about that. But guys, that's going to wrap up today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. I am beyond excited to start this project. Like I said before, mid to late August when you guys can expect that first video. But that's going to wrap it up for today, guys. Hope you all enjoyed and I will see you all later. Peace.